Hey everybody, today we're taking a look at this small safe. This is from Flohi. You can get this on Amazon. Check down below for the link so you can purchase this. This is a digital safe and it does have a key back up right here. Now this does have a little cover, but I took it off because I already used the key. And let's take a look inside what comes with it. You can see it's a pretty thick door because it is a digital safe. We have the instruction manuals. We have the batteries, we have the emergency keys, and we actually have concrete anchors, so you can anchor this to a floor, or a concrete floor, or wood, whatever you would like to do. If you look at the bottom, you can see that it does have mount holes. First, what we want to do is we want to go ahead and insert the battery, so we will take this off. So make sure you insert in the right direction. Okay, so it just came on. We'll put the cover back. Now, it's kind of hard to see. However, right on the inside of the door here, let's see if you can see that. There's a little red button. We want to press that. Now on the front, the yellow light's going to blink. That's going to show you where it's at. Uh, we want to change our code. So for demonstration purposes, I'm going to do, it's three to eight characters, I believe, but I'm going to do four, two, three, four, five. We press C and E together. Okay, so it beeped. Make sure we have the emergency keys. Do not lock these in the safe, put them somewhere safe. Okay, so now it's locked. Now what we want to do is go ahead and press our code. One, two, three, four. C and E together. And it opened. Now we're into the safe. Now let's take a closer look inside the safe. You have key holders here. You can put whatever you want to in the safe. This is a thick door. And it does have two large bars here. You can see that and that's what locks it into place. So it's a secure door. The hinge is on the inside. Let's. We have to Unlock it again here. See you need together. Okay, so now we can pull that in. So we'll put these, we'll put the anchors back inside. We'll put these somewhere where they'll be safe. And then this is the cover for the emergency. Let's go ahead and lock that. A key. Try to make it inconspicuous. Uh, this safe is, I know it's hard to see, eight, eight and a half inches, or eight and three quarter inches long. It is six and a quarter inches deep, and it's six and a quarter inches high. The opening. The opening in order to get things in here are four and a half inches by five and a half inches. So you can put a lot of valuables and little things in there. Let's put a little jar in here just to show you. That fits in there just fine. It's locked, it's not going anywhere. So if you have this mounted, it's very user friendly. If the batteries die, you have emergency keys. If you forget your code, you have emergency keys. You can reset it. You can use this anywhere you want. Use your valuables. This is made of steel. It is welded. If we look at the back of it, you can also mount this on a wall or to a floor or to a floor and a wall if you want to put it in a corner. I hope that you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe. Don't forget to like the video. We'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.